Hello everyone and welcome to this devlog. It's been a little bit, uh, but there's some, some cool new stuff I want to talk about for Goblin Summer Camp. Uh, the first thing you're seeing here on the screen is just some gameplay of the newest game mode that I've added, which is uh, Death Run, which is very similar to how Gary's Mod has their sort of Death Run game, where you're trying to make it to the, the end of this long, uh, well, it's kind of short, um, section of traps that an enemy tagger is trying to uh, stop all the goblins from getting through. Uh, the point structure is pretty simple. Basically, it's for, like, let's say there's five people who are doing the run, five green goblins. If the first person gets to the end, they get five points, the next person gets four, then three, then two, and then you're, you're out. Um, and the red goblin gets points for every person who dies. So uh, one point per, per person who doesn't make it in in time, or doesn't make it in via a trap. So it's, it's a very simple game mode, and though it took quite a while to get the traps networked correctly, so that way they, they appear synchronized well enough for everybody, um, I think I've got a nice base now that I can start building out a lot more of these maps. And uh, I, it's, it's really fun, actually. We got a, a big group here to play together, probably like, oh, I don't know, like 10 people. And it was super fun, and I always love the, the interactions, because there's so little player-to-player uh, -player interaction. You just see people crouch at each other and, uh, and re-aggressively, and I think it's always super funny. Um, I'll definitely add in some, some emotes at some point, but I think for now it's, it's really cute. I think it's funny watching people do the, the manner crouch at each other. Um, let's see. So coming up next, let me take a look at the, the feedback and request logs here. I think in the next sort of iterations of Goblin Summer Camp, as we work our way towards the final, uh, product, I need to start getting in some quality of life features like resolution settings and other gameplay settings like key bindings. I think would be really nice to get in, and maybe I'll start focusing on that for the next update. Um, I think maybe just one or two speedrun levels are left to make uh, for the final product, or I should say for the initial release. Um, I think we're all filled up on the goblin tag maps. There's still some hide and seek maps I have left to create. And then obviously I need to fill out uh, some more of these death run maps. I might make another game mode where there is no red goblin and it's very similar where you just all have to try to run over the obstacle courses in time uh, without anybody pressing any traps. It's just you against, against the environment. So that might be one more mode I make. I would like to definitely get out with four modes. Um, may, or sorry, with five modes, but maybe we'll do a sixth one as well. Maybe I will end up doing uh, Capture the Flag or something of that, that sort. Or maybe a survival type mode I think could be fun, where everyone's working together to survive. Right now there's actually not too many terrible game-breaking bugs, which is nice. Um, even though when I add a new mode, usually there are some bugs uh, that get added in addition. So far, so good. Um, yeah, the current queue it looks like for the bug list is pretty small, which is nice. Oh, I would also like to add in some more power-ups for the various game modes that use them. I think uh, it's starting to get a little stale, and it'd be nice to have some more in there. And um, and maybe to, to tune up the ones that currently exist. All right, well, that's your, your quick update. Uh, if you have any questions, please hop into the Discord and let me know. And if you want to affect uh, future development of the game, you please put those in the feedback and request channel. I do add quite a lot of them, uh, so let me know what you want. All right, guys, take it easy. Bye.